Where are you going? Trying to make it into the You don't taste bad for 45 calories, but you can taste the fact that it's probably cheap. They weren't cheap. They just don't taste that good. Or it's they probably the weird, caramel. They have a weird uh, aftertaste. Yeah, they do. But they taste weird. It's just that oh, my throat's really dry from it. Oh, it's gonna start chocolate. No. No, it does. me, it does. Desk because it's gonna die and I'm gonna be able to keep it Okay. And if it's there, it's gonna be. It never makes you happy. What's up, Striker? What's going on, dude? GG? But we didn't GG anything, we died. this hallway, oh my god. Alright, nothing. Here we go! The first item, the first thing we pick up is champion. Wow, where was that last run? Unbelievable. And we got a water ring. Yeah, we got a water ring uh, last run, too. So if we've seen two water rings, like if I've seen it before, does that mean it's a water ring? Or a water rung? <laughs> Stop looking at me like that. What the hell? You. You looked at me weird. You're trying to floss. In the in the living room, Crystal? Yeah. Flossing is for the bathroom. And you do it to your teeth. Yeah, well, I do it to That's weird. Do they just not make chargers for your thing? I don't know. said it was compatible with Should have got an iPhone like the rest of the human planet. The human population, I mean. Uh, Android is superior to iPhones. In what Why way? Every way? The easiest one to terribly cameras? I don't ever take pictures. The problem is, Androids may, I don't even know if that's true, I have no idea. They may or may not have superiority to uh, iPhones, but the problem is, everyone has an iPhone, and you gotta have what everyone else has, no, so everyone can be built, so all the programs and stuff and the apps are all functioning together. I'm not a fanboy, I just like the iPhone, it's a lot easier to use. No, I'm not. Zap. We got Champion, we got Zap, we are doing good so far. Go on, shoot, you're not getting this. Who? What, he's going with the thread? He can't play with thread around him, you know he's gonna go for it. I'm not playing with thread, I'm stitching. You're playing with it, according to him. See, he's already trying to get it. Oh, I'm gonna sit on my knees. iPhone less likely to be hacked. That's what I always assume that the iPhones are pretty secure, including the apps, since I think Androids are like open source. Androids are.
shit, I didn't even think about not looking for cores. Oh my god, I didn't even, I didn't even find them. And what's up, Jesse? Oh, we're gonna gore! Shit, I didn't want to run in that. That's oh, only two. It's only two. I see the skeletons at the core. Gets away from me. I think I can kill a spooky skeleton. Well, we're casting dragon like we did last- No! That's exactly what happened last time! They killed Guy! Alright. We're good. We're good. Alright, well, we all got levels but Guy. He's dead, dead. All right, well, I can't revive him. He is gone, pecan. Oh, all we can do is just keep opening. Oh God, there's a party room somewhere around here. I think. If I can get Rally or Valor. Well, actually, I'd rather just a regain or a miracle. I can't afford the, the, co the cost on that shit. Well, I actually did not get into a battle with that. Okay, so the stairs are up here with this guy. But we got the levels to run away. We'll grab that. It's a miracle! Now I don't mind if we get Rally or Valor. Actually, I never mind if I get it at all. I don't care. I'd rather have it than not have it, even if it costs MP. Mystery penis! Don't worry, guys. I think the fiance knows me enough to where she doesn't get weirded out by the things that I say. Do you ever get weirded out by the things that I say? No, you don't. You love me, and you know it. You know what? You... If you think I'm weird, well, let me let me tell you something about that. Valor. I may be weird, and that's fine. But guess what? You're attracted to the weird. You know what? I you actually leave. like I it. I don't like it, but you do. I can leave at any time. You can't. You're stuck with yourself. Why am I stuck with myself? No, I'm not. You return briefly. <laughs> Frequently. No, I'm okay. I'm a, I'm a cool guy, IRL. The crickets? It's been crickets all night. You're a cricket. You ever played cricket? Really? You've never- I mean, have you ever seen the sport cricket? I think I've seen it. It's pretty cool, like, they have- they have these guys, right? And they, um... They go outside, and they- And they rub their legs together, they stick them in the air, and they just rub them together, and they go... Eah! It's a pretty good sport. <laughs> Some good players in that one. Shout out to the staff, shout out to the staff. Backwards is fats. Alright, let's go. Let's get some time saving. Alright, another miracle's always good. That means I can spam zap for a bit. Trying to find them stairs. Regain, good. That means I don't have to cast Valor. For every regain I get, I don't have to cast Valor. Stairs. I don't think I had a small spell. No, I had Blizzard. I got. I think I got that a little bit ago. All right, good. Let's get let's get rolling. 
Magic fruit! It looks like fortune cookies! Alright, no stairs over there. Alright, we got this guy. He sucks, but we got him. I was trying to move him out the way, so if I had to come back, he'd be moved, but I don't think I need to. Probably a better way. Really? This didn't connect to that? I guess if this goes left, it has to. Yeah, okay. Well, we're not fighting, so the easiest way to not lose resources would be to move this guy that was trying to move earlier. There we go. So smart. What? What was that laugh? Boo boo da boo. <laughs> chain mail. You ever gotten chain mail? You know, if you don't send, like, that email to, like, 20 different people, a ghost is gonna haunt you in your sleep. And people are like, oh my god, well, just in case. Just in case. I mean, you never know. <laughs> there could be a ghost out there. the bed at 8 o'clock. <laughs> it's so quiet. Oh! Whoa! Let's go this way. Well, we're getting a lot of potions and stuff, and we do have the MP to survive. I guess I need to, like, tell people what I'm doing. So basically, we're looking for different kind of weapons and gear uh, in order to kill the jelly at the end. That's not one of them. Um, we don't have any deadlies. The deadlies allow me to instantly kill enemies at an 80% rate, but they get cursed on your character. Um, there's good ones and there's bad ones. The good ones are the ones where I uncurse them. They have an item called a curse lifter, so you, you can take those items off, even though they get cursed on your characters. You do it with a curse lifter. Uh... The Curse Lifter allows you to equip and unequip the item, and, and the items when they're cursed, they have the 80% instant death rate that works on every enemy but shadow or undead type enemies. Um, let me split here. They, um, when they get uncursed, some of them gain IP effects, like the Deadly Rod, for instance. When you uncurse the Deadly Rod off of Artie, it gains an, uh, an IP attack called Devastation. Which at a 33% cost of IP. Oh, wait, hold on, there's a core right here. It's really big. Um, it, you, it, it hits one eighth of any enemy's HP, and that includes the jelly. Crap. So you can see, like, you can use it three times in the jelly. It's pretty strong. The big one that we're looking for is not a cursed weapon, it's called the Decker Blade. And the Decker Blade, obviously, only Decker can wear it. Um, and that one does half of any enemy's HP, including the jelly. So it does, like, five... Anywhere between, like, 4,700 to 5,000. Uh, 4,700 to, like, 6,000-something on the jelly. The range is really high. On average, it does about 5,000. Uh, the cores give me really quick levels. They give high EXP, but they have a high runaway rate. Um, they only appear on certain floors, like 11 through 14, 32 through 34, uh, 41 through 44, and then 58 through 62. Or I think it's 61. Um, they give you high EXP. I don't really need these because they're so close to the next set of cores. They're kind of more of like another safety set of cores. The, 
the 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 20s kind of hit you hard with a bunch of different enemies, but the 30s and 40s really aren't that bad. So I don't really consider these cores necessary. Like the red cores are necessary. You can't. You just can't live from level one all the way to uh, the 40s. It just doesn't happen. Oh shit. It, I mean, it happens, it's rare, but when you go to fight the core, only three of you are going to gain a level. Because no matter what, if it hits you, you'll die. Somebody will die, whoever it hits. And if they all stay and they all hit you, you die. Although, I've never seen that happen, but it would be pretty funny. I'm not looking for cores right now, even though this is the last floor they can spawn on, I'm looking for stairs. I have zap, so I have options. Uh, if assassins decide to pop up, I can one-shot them all, and it gives me, like, 6,000 XP, so... Getting cores isn't absolutely essential, but if I don't get a back attack on those cores, or if they kill Artie, I'm gonna die, so... We gotta be careful here. Alright, we're out of core territory. We really need stairs, is what we need. Getting stairs early is always a good thing. Like, right there, that's fine. That was a big room with the uh, assassin floors. And I'm saying it right, assassin, that's what they're called in the game. They're called assassin. And I think that's an actual word. It's like an old way of saying assassin or something, if I remember correctly. I just call it assassin. Okay. Here we go. Let's go, let's go. No assassin. None there. There's a blue chest, and I want it. Always grab your blue chest, because those are really good. You can get a Gaty's Blade. That's like one of the other super important items we're looking for. I mean, it's a special item. You either get it or you... I mean, it's really, really rare to get it. But if you do get it from a blue chest, it's one of the best items you can have for the jelly. It does the most static, just flat damage that you can do. That is really good right there, too, though. <laughs> Not gonna lie. That Mega Axe is very good. I can make that. Alright, we're on the last floor of this area, then we get into the cave area, which the next floor also has green cores. Now, when it comes to cores, we're going to look for them, because we absolutely need green cores. I don't think we can survive without them. Now, see the stairs, so we're going to go for that instead of this guy. Alright, green cores, let's find them. We need them. We need them. I'm not too worried about that. It sucks. I knew it was off step. Okay. Well, looks like I have to go this way. I should be able to make it. Shit, dude. Oh, it's only one. Whatever. It's super strong at the moment because I'm so low level. Okay. That's fine. Let's just get out of here. Get out of here! Whoa. Alright, no core on this floor. Yeah, also, by the way, there could just be no cores. <laughs> like, they could just not appear. So it is a thing that we have to watch out for. Alright, no door over there. There's a core. There he is! Just a quick heal. Because they can use Vortex if they're there. Oh my god, it's only one. It didn't stay. The blue one did. It's not the best EXP, but it's EXP. It's hard to complain about it. It's not a lot. It gives 11, 11, 11. Or whatever, but the green cores give 30, 30. <laughs> Not bad, just not good. Oh, great. All right, this is the last safe floor. 
that we can find cores on. Because the next floor, ninjas start spawning. They can and they will. I do see that core. I don't think it's worth it. There's too much shit. Great. No, oh, another one! Damn it! Um, no, there's a color difference between the regular mimics and the, uh, and the blue mimics, between the, you know, their respective red chest and blue chest. There's a, there's a visible difference. Um, and that's what I would go off of. I wouldn't go by, um, their location. Uh, because it's not a guarantee. It's not, it's not the best... Ah, oh, the stairs are in that room. Oh, that's really bad. I gotta kill this manually. I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna attack, because with the Gorgon, the Gorgon Rock, I should be able to kill them pretty good. Um, I mean, a lot of times you can tell by their position, you can. Like, if they're up against a wall or they're in a hallway, it's obviously, like, where chests normally aren't. Um, but if you go by the way that they look, you'll be a lot, it'll be a lot better for you. A lot safer. Because then sometimes you might get confused and then try and get one that you shouldn't have. Really? I didn't kill that? I should have attacked with Max and be gone. I forgot he had that sword on. 6,000, it's really not that bad. I really don't know what's in that, um... Party room. I can't believe I have to go in there. That's making me angry. I guess that means I'm getting the core after all. Oh, wait! All right, this is ninja territory. We are in nin- oh, great. Do we have to fight that? I don't know yet. Nope, we don't have to fight it. Okay, good. The ninjas are gonna last, I think, till 48. Okay, let's check over here first. Upstairs. I want the oh, I'm going for the stairs. We're only level 16, but if we can get past ninjas, ninjas are gonna be the one thing that'll kill us for right now. There's a few things that we can run into. Like that. If I can get him over, I'll be alright. I can't really move up or anything because he's why is that thing not moving? That's really weird. That's the most swings I've ever done without an enemy moving. Because ninjas, I don't think, will really kill us. I mean, ninjas will kill us, but if we can get past it, we'll be all right. Like, right now, I think we have one more floor, and then we're safe. Okay. We're not picking up, by the way, because typically you want to save, like, a big chunk of time. The easiest way to save time is not picking up chest. Every chest you pick up is four seconds. Or it's, like, three point something. All right, we're safe from ninjas. We're going to start picking up again at, uh, 50. Just next floor, or I could wait till 60. It just depends on where you're at and what you have. Because you gotta be careful. Man. I don't wanna do any of this, but the stairs are down here. That's not good. That's not good. That's okay. Do I have an X potion for that? I do. Expect with that. Okay. Okay. Dude, they wanted to kill him. That's six. All right. What's the math on that? Six one fifths in a row. What's the math? That is super fucking insane. That's a one in five chance of those things hitting anything, and they all hit Decker six times in a row. That's insane to me. Six times? Out. 
I just want to go. I'm, I'm supposed to be picking up, but so much shit in the way. All right, you know what? We'll just go around. Jeez! What's going on in that room? <laughs> I want to be in there. Wait, that just goes right back where we were, so this is obviously the best place to go. Yep, and this connects to the left. It's great. That's actually really good. If it didn't connect, I'd have a problem. Like, I'd have to at least kill one of those Hades. I have Valor, so I could have killed him with Valor, but Valor has a long casting animation, so I'm saving myself time not having to fight them. Oh, these stairs are really in a shitty place. Crystal Mail! Alright, so the next set of cores is at 58 through 62. Um, and like I said, there's not too many things that are really bad right here. There's a couple of things I gotta watch out for. And I did get those blue cores, so... I have a, a couple of levels on me. And I've got some decent gear. The Mega Axe and stuff and the Red Saber for fire damage is both good. Get that, I can't... That's a Hydora. They're weak to ice, which I don't know if I have Ice Valkyrie. I wasn't paying attention, but I have Zap and stuff. Alright, there's stairs. We have to pick up, though. Uh, I have not been getting good stairs, though, so... Refreshing to get that one good stare. <laughs> Bubba da boom. Oh, fuck, he moved over to the right. The stairs can be in there, but that thing might kill me. I made him... Oh, I didn't make a mistake. That thing just happens to be there. It's a problem. That thing can cast thunder. One thunder would probably kill me. Oh, we're good. Alright, we're coming up. One more floor! One more floor, and we're gonna start seeing no cores. Hopefully. Hopefully. And we need one, bad, because we're, we're like, mid-level right now. We're below average level that we need to be, because we didn't get any green cores. Careful. The warm eyes can be back there. We're also about to come into gold, uh, gold Gorum territory, which is a bad territory to be in, especially if we don't have any deadlies, which I don't... I think I've seen one deadly rod tonight. Usually dead, deadly rod seems like it's a more common one, but... Alright, here we are. 58. Alright, speaking of the deadlies, there is another deadly. It's called the Fatal Pick. Oh, there's two more. There's the Fatal Pick and there's a the Deadly Sword. There's two versions of the Deadly Sword. There's two items with the same name. The, uh... The Deadly Sword has two different... Like, there's two different kinds. One's the bad one and one's the one that actually does instant death. And you can tell which one's which by the description before you equip it. Or by the fact that only Maxim can equip it. If Decker or Guy can equip it, it's the bad one. Uh, and when you uncurse it, it gets a 1-6 HP attack uh, for the IP. Um, okay, well, no core there. Uh, there's also the Fatal Pick, which already can wear. Oh, there's a core! Already can wear it, uh, but it has no IP attack when you uncurse it. It's just a cursed weapon, which makes it the obviously the weakest one. Damn, it didn't stay. It still does the instant death. But you'd want the Deadly Rod. We'll go that way after. No, I'll go that way now. Because I'm going to have to fight and engage and whatnot, but this one I know I can get in without having to fight anything. And there's a core in here! Oh, it stayed. Thank God. We're getting a no-core. We are getting a no-core. 
at this level, look how bad it's gonna hurt us, too. Damn. I wish both of them would have stayed. The leveling would have been insane. So that's 55,555 EXP. Oh, that felt so good. We're still not even in a good range. I need a little bit more uh, HP. A couple more levels. All right, I'm not gonna pick up till 60. Well, it's 60 now, but... You can start getting Lizard Blows on 50, but 60 you can start getting Myth Blades. Uh, Lizard Blow is just a really high attacking weapon. It's super strong, and it has a 3x attack. Uh, so when you attack, it does three times damage. That's what its IP is. Now, the thing about the Lizard Blow, why it's so good is everyone can wear it, including Guy. And Guy being able to wear a 3x weapon is huge, because ordinarily he doesn't get one. Oh, it stayed! Holy shit! Uh, he doesn't get one. Uh, everyone can wear it, even Artie. Even Cell and T Alexis, they can all wear it. Um, the Myth Blade is just a, another really high attack power weapon. And that one's really good because it does one-fourth of HP. Like, that's its IP attack, because it'll do one-fourth of any enemy's HP. That includes the jelly. It's a really good, uh, weapon. There's also the old sword that spawns at 50, which does 1-6. It's also high attacking power. Not as high as Myth Blade, but still high. It does 1-6. It also uses a lot less IP. I think it uses 51 as opposed to 80-something for the Myth Blade. So you can actually follow up with another weapon, with another IP, with the old sword. A good combination is the Cancer Rock. The Cancer Rock allows you to attack twice. Um... And you can use that with the old sword. So you can hit it for 1-6, and you can do the old sword damage. I mean, the, uh, the, the cancer rock damage as well. We don't have anything yet for the jelly. No decker blade, old sword, or myth blade. So, really, we need a lot of stuff still. I'm gonna pull him. I need to move. So in case I have to go up there. It's better to do it now, rather than having to turn around. One more step, one more step. I think I'm gonna have to go up there. Oh, no. This room is connected to the top. So we didn't have to do that, but we didn't know. Stairs? No. Okay, let me grab that. Where are my stairs? Oh, there they are. That's a weird stair position. The stairs can also spawn in funky places sometimes, like right outside doors and shit. They can even spawn, like, surrounded by chest. Oh, that's a warm eye. We do not want to fight that. We have the levels too, but we do not want to fight that. Very fast enemy. Always usually in uh, groups of four. It's pretty nasty. It has a lot of attacks. Wastes just a lot of time. Mine gourd. No god. It's the second one we've seen today. All right, there's a little green vine over there. This is no bueno. I didn't mean to do that. That's really bad. I'm gonna have to pull him closer. Okay. I can get down to that door, which is no problem. September iris percent? Not likely. We were still like 60 subs away. <laughs> we're not doing it early, just because there's a whole bunch of them either. <laughs> we're good, we're good. Now we're not good. I want to go in here. I don't have any fire. This makes this very frustrating. These things can actually hurt me really bad, like almost kill me. And what's up, Rojo? Rojo? Sama? What's crackle I can do? 
Yeah, right there. Paralyzed. Nope, no one got paralyzed. Great. Well, Sully's dead. Do not confuse Maxim. That's scary. Final Fantasy XIV dailies? I still, like, I've only played Final Fantasy XIV just a couple of times. Like, literally, the, the when it came out, I played it one day. I liked it, but my computer couldn't handle it at the time. And then when the second expansion came out, I played it. And I enjoyed it. I just, I never got back into it. I'm interested in WoW Classic, because, I mean, I grew up in WoW and stuff, and that's what I played. So that's what I've been playing. But I hear, I always hear that Final Fantasy XIV is really good. And not only do I hear it's really good, I hear this expansion's, like, the best. Like they said, it's only gotten better, which really interests me, but I just, I'm not, I haven't gotten into it, so I don't know anything about the game. I didn't have to go over there either. Now I gotta somehow make it down here. Ooh! That's what everyone says, that the writing is really good. That's what I hear. Like, they say, like, the story's super good. The base game. Like, what do you mean by, like, the base game? Is it kind of like how WoW works, where you have to go through all the content? Like, you have to, like, every, like, level area is kind of like a, like an expansion content thing. The story's amazing. Damn. I don't own it, and I don't have a subscription for it, or else I would. I mean, money's tight, so I gotta... I gotta keep it all, you know, where the best... Or like my interest, I like wow. I, I, I like I have a subscription to wow. Yeah, so I'm guessing like when you start the character, you play through like Heaven Sword, then you go through I think it was like Stormblood or something, and then you go into the third one. That's cool. I mean, do you do any of the like are, are is it kind of like wow or like raids are kind of dead or do they reincorporate them into the game? I know Lord of the Rings Online did. I didn't know about Final Fantasy though, but I know like Lord of the Rings Online used to do something like that. Well, no, 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 not, not that they don't exist, but, like, it, like, the, the endgame content of Heaven Sword, would you still, would you be able to play that? Like, would you be able to do that content, or is it really you don't do that anymore? Kind of like, wow. That's what I meant, I'm sorry. I gotta get him out of here, but now that he's stuck in there. It's one of the dailies. Oh, that's cool. At least you get to see all the content. I saw a few of the fights. As someone who's really big in the Final Fantasy, well, not the newer ones. The newer ones I really haven't played, like 12 through 15. I own them all, but I just never played them. And all the 13 sequels. But, um, like, it was cool seeing stuff like, uh, like the Phantom Train fights and the Kefka fight thing that they had. That was cool. I thought that was interesting. BC and Raph. Yeah, well, yeah, BC and Raph, definitely. I don't have too, too, I don't have any experience in vanilla, which is why I wanted to play it. Because, um, I didn't really get to experience it back then because I played Maple Story, But I missed out on vanilla. But I played a lot of BC. I raided in BC. But I didn't get very far. I think, I think I got up to, like, Serpent Shrine Cavern. But Wrath, I was doing Lich King. Like, we got up to Lich King. And we were doing that pretty, pretty regularly. Um, I can't wait for those. But I also wouldn't mind getting my vanilla on, you know? Like, actually doing things I haven't done, like Cthulhu or something, or Ragnaros, or... You know, Onyxia and its prime. Not doing, like, Onyxia during Wrath. I'd like to do something like that. But I'm only level 14. I just, I haven't had time to put into it between, like, streaming and everything else that I do. Yeah, the quality of life stuff is good. Some of it. Some of it's good. There's other parts that aren't good, that made WoW not very good. Um, but some of the other quality of life stuff, I don't really, I'm not really that against. But there's always retail. There, I'm, I don't even think it counts as retail, but there's always the, the, the newer expansion. There's always that. You can always do that. Like, since I'm sub to Classic, I can just play the new expansion. Like, because I have it, I own it. I've owned it for a few months now. Oh, Jesus. This is terrible right here. I don't even know what to do. Um, it's not bad. Like, I, I like the convenience and all the new stuff in WoW is really interesting. Like, I like all, like, new graphics and updates and all that kind of stuff. But I do, there is something charming that I missed about classic WoW and stuff that, you know, I'd love to really go back and play, which is what I'm trying to do. 
it's like a game you can't play anymore. It's an error you can't play anymore, which was crazy to think about. I, I can do this if I can get to the left, but this dragon is really being a fuck up. All right, I can do this. Oh, that is so fucking lucky. Well, I hear- I mean, I don't know how much quality of life Final Fantasy XIV has, because like I said, I never played it. But I feel like I couldn't do it. Like, I feel like it's too late. Like, I'd be playing- I'd be going into a game... Um, way too late. I don't know why I did that. That was the stupidest thing we've ever done. Like, that I wouldn't get a lot of the stuff. Like, a lot of the references or stuff, like... Or, I mean, I'd be so far behind, like, I don't get any of the special event items, I missed all the events, uh, the game would be too far into, like, lore or dungeons or, you know, I, it, I would basically be playing, like, a new player, but also catch-up, right? Like, I would be playing so much catch-up just trying to learn the game. And I, I struggle with that kind of stuff, so I can imagine in an MMO, like, how much I'd have to learn. Oh, Jesus. Oh, I'm so dead. Maybe not. I like lore, but like if I'm reading lore, I'm like, ugh. Like, uh. I just wanna like start, you know, I just wanna level and whatnot, or I wanna do stuff. But I mean, with a game that has good lore, like WoW, I feel like I need to read it. But I've played WoW so much, I already know all the lore. Like, I know all of it. And I don't want to, like, so I can just skip quests and all that kind of stuff. But for, for that game, I'd have to learn it. So I'd have to sit there and take it quietly. But like I said, I don't, I don't know. I haven't, I've never, I've only, I've only played it for, like, a couple of hours, two days. For each expansion. Except for the third one. I haven't done my one day on that one. <laughs> <coughs> Sorry. Talking too much. Yeah, like you do Realm Reborn content, then you go into the next one, and then the next one. I mean, I just, I get like really like to a point, because I know if I play like a game like that, I have to play it by myself. Because if I played it with somebody else, like I know it's an MMO, but if I played it like with somebody else that like brought me everywhere and did all that stuff, it would feel like playing games like where people just run ahead and because they know everything and you don't. Main story and class quests. What are some good classes? Like, I know there's a whole bunch. I know you also only make, like, one character because you can be every class or something. Like, your character can have every job, every class. That I kind of liked about WoW. It felt like you had, like, an identity. I can probably get past this guy. Do I have a deadly? Thought I did. No, that's the bad, that's the bad one. This was probably not my best idea. I don't know if I'd want to heal. I, I made a, a, a dragoon. Like a Dark Knight dragoon or whatever it was. That's what I made when I played the couple of days that I did. And I probably never even played the new content. I, I just started where my character was and that was it. All this to avoid that one genie, which is actually pretty good on my part. I don't- the, the idea of healing does fascinate me. Like, I'm playing WoW Classic, I pull my Warlock, but I don't really feel like there's anything to do. Like, at the end of the day, I'm just, like, a damage dealer. <clears throat> I don't get anything fun. Like, I'd like to play a mage, because you can pour it and you can make your own food, like, it's cool. And, and food is super important in, in WoW. Um... But a healing, I do want to make a paladin, or a priest, I think, at some point, and want to try out healing. I've never healed. Throughout all of my wild time, I've mainly played, holy shit, Deckerblade. I mainly played a warrior, or a warlock. Mainly the warlock. The warlock is 95%, and the warrior is the other part. And I tanked. Not like raids or anything, but I tanked, and I was pretty good at it. But, um, Warlock, I've done all the specs, and I've played whatever was the best at the time and all that. But I've never done healing. I think I've only ever healed, like, maybe a couple of, a handful of times. 
on like an alt character for like a minute, but it was all in like heirloom gear and whatnot. That's what my cousin plays. I mean, he played uh, Resto Druid for all. Like, he used to be a damage dealer, but then he realized he was just a better healer than he was damage dealer and just kind of embraced it. But I know I'm good as a warlock. Like, I know I'm a, I'm a warlock at heart. But I wouldn't mind, like, tank healing or something like a paladin and whatnot. <clears throat> but as far as, like, Final Fantasy XIV goes, I don't know what I'd play, because I don't know the game. I was thinking maybe, like, a ninja or a dark knight or something. I didn't know if they were going to be any good, or a thief, or just something fun. A shitty warlock. I was a good warlock. Damn, Decker Blade and Mythblade, and uh, no curse, li uh, no curse weapons on. I could probably go. I could try. I need to get my IP up though. Dark Knight's cool as hell. I can't. Well, I can't play play something with me. Like what? Final Fantasy fourteen? I can't. I don't own it. <laughs> I don't have a subscription for it either. <laughs> All right, we got some good stuff. We could PB. I shit you not. Mm -hmm. Wait, I can't even do that anyway. I don't have an instant death. I mean, I do, but I'm not equipping it. Talking about MMOs, huh? All right, well, we're equipping that one. <laughs> if we see a dragon. Because I don't mind equipping it on uh, Artie. Oh, that was almost really bad. I never played Guild Wars, ever. I think the only time I've ever played it was on your computer a long time ago, when we were playing Gumbound. You know what? I miss yeah. Gum... Yeah. I miss Gumbound. In fact, fuck all those games. We're all playing Gumbound. From now on, that's what we're doing. That's We're investing your time into Gumbound and maybe Maple Story. Sorry, guys. I'm sorry. That's just the way it's gotta be. <laughs> I'm sorry. I, I, I mean, I don't, I don't have any other way. Alright, well, we got the deadly on. There's gotta be a better way. Alright, genie. I can't. Fucking dragons. Alright, I was gonna try and get a back attack on one of those dragons, but apparently no. That is not good. Hopefully the stairs are nowhere near that guy. I think the stairs are up near up there near that guy. I really shouldn't be going. Come on, hit me with the voltage bolt. Hit me with the voltage bolt. Please, that would be awesome. God damn it. That would have been awesome. I wouldn't have needed to farm a dragon. Looks like that's what's gonna happen. I don't know. I'm interested. I've been interested in Final Fantasy XIV since I saw the trailer. I saw that cat and I was like, that's cool. That cat with the sword. I don't know who that was, but he was cool. I think that was the right trailer. I think of the right game. They like slayed a dragon. Have to pick up. I just don't think I have enough. I gotta get rid of this genie. Shit. Come on, Mr. Genie. Let's go.
Oh, there was nothing in there the whole time. What? That doesn't mean what I think it means. Oh, there's a door down here. Alright, let's just go through the stairs. We'll farm when we can. Well, this is a predicament. Oh, it's only one. Nice. Cinderblast, Cinderblast, come on, do it. No, we need you to Cinderblast ASA penis. No, don't hit the one guy that has full IP. Please. I beg you, dragon, give me, give me one good cinder blast, please. I need IP penis. We got the stairs too. Come on. No, stop hitting the one guy with full IP. That's so fucked up. There we go. There we go. Come on. Please don't kill Artie. Alright, nobody's dead. That's enough IP because Artie doesn't have anything, so it doesn't matter. Alright, we're gonna have to go for it. We just gotta try. We just gotta go with what we have. If we can make it, there's always a chance that we just can't make it. Like, right now, this sucks. Well, he's got enough room for me to get in there. Come on, man. Stairs, please, stairs. What the fuck, dude? Dude, for fuck's sake! That means the stairs are over there to the right, and I can't get to them. Please, please. Please just go left. I beg you. Good thing I didn't try and fuck with those. I would have been very upset. Oh my god. This is ridiculous. Well, we killed it. That was the worst part. I can't believe this shit. I like how I'm just trying to run to the end, and there's just nothing but dragons blocking all my paths. Thank god. That was rough. That was really rough to do. I gotta be careful here. Okay. A lot of open areas. Jesus fucking Christ. Alright. It's just so many doors, man, just to get to the stairs. Well, that was weird. I was surrounded by bushes. Oh, God! Dragon Con! Dragon Con! This is also a big, fat fucking if. It's what it is. It's a big if if we can even kill the damn thing. All we have is Decker Myth. We don't really have anything else. Wait, I have a curse up here, don't I? No, that was last run. Well, I'd only be able to use a Deadly Rod one hit. But luckily I have Zap.
Well, the good news is, holy shit. I do have a curse lift there. Holy shit. Uh, this might be good. I'm not even gonna evolve. I don't think I have anything else. No. We're just gonna go for it, Gorgon Rock. We don't have a lot of IP, but this is all we can do. We just gotta go for it. I have no finisher though. That's the problem. Is all I have is Guy's Mega Axe, which it's not going to do a whole lot of damage. Dragon's going to cost so much fucking time. I'm just gonna, if it does like 200, I'm just going to attack with him next time. I'm just going to attack. Oh, this is it! This is it! It's the last turn, I don't know if I have anything or not. Oh, he did more Myth Blade. That's it, that's all I got. Oh! <gasps> wow, we PB! <laughs> oh, yeah, we PB! Yeah! <laughs> Dude, I've had this run for like two years. I finally fucking PB'd. Holy shit. <laughs> By a stupid minute. That's actually my second uh, sub one hour run ever. Holy shit. <laughs> wow, those are new splits. I can do a lot better. The early game was good, but the mid game sucked. <laughs> I probably could have saved maybe, maybe about like another minute not grab an extra chest, but that was it. Nothing crazier than that, but we can absolutely beat that time. We can absolutely beat that, but holy shit, my heart's pumping. It was the last attack. Yo, Ellie Santana with the follow, thank you so much. <laughs> Dude, it was the last attack. The very last one. You had to get up out of bed? Dude, I appreciate it, man. Oh, we did it. We PB'd. That's the first of a while. Let's see if I beat anybody. Let's see if I actually passed up anyone. I don't even know. <laughs> I doubt it. I doubt it. Ancient cave. Uh, yeah, actually I did. I just beat the guy above me. That was it. But I can beat this a lot better. I can beat it a lot better. Yeah, I'm gonna save the splits definitely. Yeah, I could. I can definitely. I've been like 40 minutes at the jelly before, so we gotta just gotta keep pushing it. We can do it. Oh man, I can't. I didn't think we were gonna beat me. I didn't think I was gonna get it. That's so stupid. If those dragons wouldn't block me, I probably could have been like third place. Oh my god, that's so good. Oh god, I didn't. If I didn't know I had that curse lifter. I was like, wait a minute, I think I have a cursor. We got the Deadly Rod. I was like, if I knew I had, that would have been like, I would have pieced out a long time ago. Do it again? Oh, man. I'm still going to do it. Like, I'm still going to run. The whole point's to get world record. We have both the 100% world records. Um, well, I had the original 100% for the longest time. I've never lost it. And then I improved it by, like, an impossible amount that I'm aware of. Reject percent. Somebody had beaten me. I took it back, and then I did another run, and I, uh got even further like 20 30 minute time save i think you're right i think that last level from having to kill that gold dragon might have mattered 
It made everyone about 10, 15 damage stronger. I don't know what my damage output was, though. Oh, that was so freaking close, dude. That was so close. We finally have new splits, but the end game, every split saved time, but only a little bit. Some of the times I lost, but I've been minus 15 minutes before. My mid game is still my strongest time save, right between like 60 to 80. Um, medium time save, well obviously uh, 10 to 20 is a big time save, and uh, between 30 and 50 is a big time save too, like between those set of floors. <clears throat> I still got stuck behind dragons in the final 20 floors, so that was pretty bad. Yeah, I did. The dragons really fucked me. I, this could have been a sub-55 easily if the dragons wouldn't have screwed me, but... Goddamn. Just to know I can still do it, like, sub-1 hour, man. I've had this mental block for, like, two years now. Literally, I think the last time I PB'd that 558... Or, uh, I'm sorry, that 5803 or whatever it was, I think that was, like, two years ago. And then I had the whole hiatus thing and all that, but no, that's pretty good to know I can still do it. And to celebrate it, we got our little buddy here looking at me like he wants to come up. Come here, you little shit. Come here, you little shit. Run, run, run. Oh, isn't he cute? He wants to say he's happy. Hey, guys. Thank y'all for watching my dad. Hey, buddy. Dad PB. Dad PB. For the first time in a while. You yeah, yeah, did. Yeah. Ooh, that's a me. Ooh. You look really mad. I don't like that. Why you look so mad? You don't no need to get mad. Stay glad. You're a cat. You get fed. You don't have to do anything. Oh, you're such a good cat. Mwah. Yes, you are. Mwah. Ooh. What's the matter? Why you look so mad? Who's, he, who's intimidated? Who's trying to instinctually scare me, huh? Who's trying to haunt me, huh? Whoa! All right, let's go. <laughs> he tried to slap the shit out of me. All right, guys, this is a PB one, so we have to. It is a tradition in my channel whenever we kill the jelly, but this time is very specific. This time we're gonna 